This video is part two in our three part series on internet structure. Here we look at LANs and WANs. So networks come in many shapes and sizes, and each type of network falls into one of several categories. As you can see, there are many categories, but the two you need to focus on for your exam are local area networks, a LAN, and wide area networks, a WAN. A local area network is any network that covers a small geographical area, typically located on a single site. All the hardware for a LAN tends to be owned and controlled by the organisation using it. LANs are typically connected using UTP cable, fibre optic and Wi-Fi. Your home network and all the devices you have in it make up a local area network. A wide area network or a WAN is any network that covers a large geographical area. When multiple LANs physically located in different areas are connected, they form a WAN. The infrastructure that connects LANs to form a WAN typically is leased from telecommunication companies who own and manage it. WANs are typically connected by telephone lines, fibre optic cables and satellite links. Having watched this video, you should be able to answer the following key question. What are the main differences between a LAN and a WAN?